what can I affirm to change the story about feeling abandoned that I'm chosen? Thank you. No one ever abandoned me. The major story about being abandoned comes from childhood where I was sexually abused my brothers are. But my parents and cousins chose their side over me. I've talked about it in therapy, but I still have this family around me constantly until I leave the school next year and it can be triggering still. Oh, darling. I still feel uncomfortable around my brothers, especially one of them who never admitted to what he did and then my parents and cousins didn't believe me. I've also gone through many other instances of sexual assault. Oh, darling. Okay. So, okay, by your brothers. Oh, God, Jesus. Okay, darling, look, I know people that that's happened to where they've gone to their parents and they haven't been believed. It's like the worst thing that could possibly happen. So it's happened to you and then the people who are meant to care and believe you don't believe it. What will then end up happening is you'll constantly be triggered in the 3D whenever someone does something. I know someone that happened to you and the parents didn't believe her and her reactions to her SP, who she's now engaged to, but still, her reactions are so extreme with him that if you don't understand her, you'll just be like, is she losing her mind? But it's because she's constantly assuming that he's going to hurt her or leave her or not believe her or not be there for her or because of the way her parents reacted to her abuse. So her triggers are really on the surface and really present and really quick with her specific person because your specific person is the person you care about the most, so they'll trigger you the most or your family will trigger you the most, okay? You can go back to that scene in your mind of telling your family and decide that they did believe you and they did hear you and you were listened to and heard or you can just accept that that happened and move on and just decide that you no longer let your triggers trigger you and you're not going to let that past destroy you. I am not my past. I do not let my past affect me. I am the new me. I don't let my triggers trigger me anymore. The past is in the past. It's dead to me now, okay? And I'm the new me.